we have start with 1120 yes 1120 how do i configure uh, and run java in ubuntu 10.04 i think we already covered this topics we already covered the topics on the second day you just go to the moodle you will get the presentation there you can download the presentation and follow the steps uh, sir, do Akash have the RJ15 socket? No, no, no. Only RJ15 Wi-Fi. Port? Only Wi-Fi. No. And sir, in our main server, do we need to install uh, this uh, Ubuntu 10.0.10.04, uh, 10 or uh, we can go ahead with a newer version? You can go with the newer version, but what are the softwares we configured? It should work. The clicker software should work. That is the only one condition. Sir, over to you. Okay, thank no, you. Thank you, sir. 1123. Uh, for uh, Wi-Fi setup, is there is any manual provided by you? No, for Wi-Fi setup, we are not at provide any menu. You can purchase an access point and connect to your network. Uh, manual for uh, with with respect to the Akash tablet configuration. Un Akash, you can connect through Wi-Fi only. So you want to purchase on Wi-Fi router or Wi-Fi access point, and you want to configure. Okay. And thank you so much. Okay. 1124 Okay, earlier clicker server, but how can we verify that it's working properly or not? Can you able to log in successfully after registration of coordinator? Yes, sir. Okay, then will you get any message like waiting for main center quiz after login successful? If you get a message like waiting for main center quiz, it means that you are perfectly connected with our IAT server. After login, what you are yes sir, we got, we got that message. Yeah, okay. sure. It means, it means that it's, you are connected with our main center. Not a problem. Okay, sir. Thank you so much. Over and out. This 1135, Periyar University. Will it be supporting any other tablet machine? Like Samsung, it is and an HTC, etc. And in Android, the Android platform, the software will support. Any other question? Sir, sir prerequisites of server configuration. Server configure you need the configuration of the server, right? It has an Intel Xeon processor, at least 8 GB RAM, 1 TB into 2 hard disk. Sir, is this support SIM card facility? No, I don't think so. Currently, there is no option. Okay, thank you, sir. Okay. 1137 RK University, Gujarat. Sir, can I net connect to the our server and Akash tablet to your computer? Our server is need to the internet? Yes, yes. The server internet is needed. Are you configured all the software? Is it working fine? Ah, sir. He is also software is working fine now. Ah, okay, thanks. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. 1144. Suppose my server is failed during the workshop. So can we have backup for that? If you need, you can configure a backup system. And what is the configuration of server? Server machine, actually. Server configuration, I told you, Intel C1 processor with minimum 8 GB RAM and two hard disks when you want to configure software right on that. Thank you, thank you, sir. 1145. I have a query regarding about the tablets. Okay, in our center, there is a 104 participants are there. So, will you provide the 104 tablets in our center? Yes. Then, thank you. Over and out. 1161 Yes sir, sir what, what software should be installed on the tablet and how to install? That we will demonstrate on 5th during the coordinators workshop. What are the softwares you want to install? Mainly it is clicker APK. If any other software is that time we will inform the coordinators. Uh, is there any last date for registering coordinator in the clicker software sir? No, there is, actually you have to configure and register everything before the workshop. You, you okay, sir. Already we have done in the system, sir. Okay, not a problem. Then it's okay, fine. But uh, we are getting a error called 500 number. HTTP 500 server error. Okay. So how you are telling that you are successfully registered? Okay, not a problem. Can you able to go for the coordinator page after? La okay, after open your browser, it so it will be open with login page. When you are clicking the coordinator registration, yes, is it is allowed to go to that page? Yes, sir. Can you able to type the, all the information? Coordinator registration. Okay. Ah, yes, sir. Is it possible to allow? Here, when we click on that uh, link, sir. Uh -huh. When we click on coordinator registration uh, click uh, link, sir. Okay. 
we are getting a error called http 500 okay it means that you are not properly connected properly install the database okay make sure you are properly configured the database as well as given a username and password as clicker underscore ui everything is small as well as you are given a permission to access the database that are privileges okay, okay. then another question is there sir you are already said that server configuration is 8 gb ram and 1 tb hard disk space and what would be the processor speed sir intel Xeon processor the speed and all the things we will put it on moodle then uh, when we uh, when we are installing a software into the tablet sir the dump should be copied into which area sir in tablet it is going to be in sd ram or a micro sd card, card or micro, uh, some micro memory card. in the tablet micro sd card okay it micro sd card yeah. it should be connected to the server using wi-fi sir yes then only it's possible to copy that software no no software maybe we will provide through micro sd card when the coordinators are coming here so maybe it is a one or two cards after that you can copy to different cards and you can use okay sir then another question is there sir how we are going to connect our server to iitb server sir if you configure the uh, remote uh, the clicker software there it will automatically connect to iitb server how to connect a tablet to iitb server oh, sir? No, right now there is no need to connect to iitb server when you connect the uh, tablet through Wi-Fi, it will automa uh, it will connect to your local server, what the server you already configured over there. That server automatically connect to IITB server. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. 1167. We have completed all the installation. We are uh, getting one error after uh, login into remote clicker website. That is network unreachable, connection refused. What can be the problem, sir? Because internet is working on that PC. Did you check that internet is working on that PC? It's open all the pages like Google. Even uh, Moodle quiz on that PC. Okay, what do you do? Just restart the restart Tomcat. Your system, restart your system. Then restart your Tomcat. My and try. And everything. Then you again you try to connect. It will connect to the IAD server. Okay, that time also it so no, same. Sir, I have already done it. I have restarted the. Yeah, same error I am. Are, are you using proxy or direct connection only? Is there any particular. No, I am accessing through the proxy, sir. Sorry, not a problem. You post it in post the Moodle. Post it in the Moodle. Then I give you the solution in Moodle. Yes, yeah, sir. I have already put in discussion forum my problem. Okay, I okay, have we given will. Some... Okay, we will give you the solution, not a problem. Okay, and sir, one more question about Wi-Fi setup. Like the, uh, uh, you have suggested TV Link Wi-Fi router. So, what is the radius of that uh, router that the client can access the router? Around 100 tablets can connect. Sir, what can be the distance? Like, uh, the, the range is up to 15 feet or 15 meter or? It's 50 feet. Any other question? No other questions, sir. Okay, thanks. Okay. Uh, to connect server and a cost tablet, is it necessary to make our access point on DHCP mode? Yeah, access point you can make it as DHCP mode. Only for access point, but the server you want to give manual IP. Manual for IP addressing not possible. Manual IP for the server and DHCP for the tablet. Manual IP is also possible the tablet but it will take time to configure you people want to put each and every tablet manual IP yeah. if you enable in the router itself when you connect to that Wi-Fi it will automatically let the IP address okay thank you sir 1173 our local server is working well under proxy connection is it enough or we have to give public IP address to connect with IITB server no, no, you already configured the software and it is connected to the IITB server, right? Ah, uh, it's connected. It's working well. Are you configured the clicker software? Yes, sir. Okay. Are you logged in in that software? Logged in the software using coordinators ID login. Yes. You mean coordinators? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, sir. Whether you created the coordinators? No, sir. I haven't logged in. No, you supposed to create a coordinator station. It is available in the login page itself. One, is, one link is there, coordinator registration. With the help of that 
link you supposed to give the username password as well as your center name after registration you supposed to log in then you check whether it is getting the message like waiting for main center quiz if you are receiving that message it means that you are connected with our server if you have any problem just you contact us through forum moodle forum there are we have wifi device is it enough to connect the uh, tablets yes thank you sir 1178 Okay, what uh, uh, which kind of device we can use for the uh, uh, in Wi-Fi? Is it, is it possible to means, uh, use only router or we uh, require the access point also? Router, otherwise access point. Whatever things you are comfortable, you can use. But uh, sir, which one is better? If we, you have router, then you can configure a DHCP server inside the router. it is very easy for you otherwise you want to keep if you are using an access point you want to keep a dhcp server you want to configure a dhcp server over there and you want to connect on that okay and sir uh, will you provide uh, all the videos of this uh, session yeah all the videos we will put it on open source it will be available on nme ict website but it will take some time and one more question sir ah uh, will you provide a tablet to all the technical staff also Uh, here we are register four technical staff yeah. i think professor fatak professor fatak already mentioned that maybe we will provide the tablets but there has some conditions is there i think so we will check the quizzes and all if all the people are attended then only they will get as i am already mentioning from the first day onwards quizzes are mandatory for all Around 800 people are registered. Only around 450 are attending the quiz. So maybe the remaining people will not get. But right now, right now there is no provision to give the technical staff. This is only for those who are registered for 10th and 11th workshop. But the discussion is going on. Okay, thank you, sir. No. One one nine four. Gandhi Engineering College. Sir, we configure everything, and whenever we uh, go through the browser, the home page of IIT Bombay uh, will appear in our screen. Uh, then, how can we confirm that uh, our server is uh, created perfectly? No, it is created. You are registered with coordinator user ID and password. Sir, it asks the username, password, and coordinator for registration and all those things. Okay, you are there. You log in successfully. Ah, uh, but so which username password I have to log in, sir? Yeah, the same. What you are you have registered with that link? Coordinator registration. Ah, uh, my mo my model model. No, 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 no model user. No model user. No model user. No model user. Software. Then ah, uh, so which username password I have to log in? Sir, first first you want to register on that software. That time it will ask for username and password. That user through using that username and password, you can log into. that software okay the, uh, i have to log in through that uh, coordinator registration yeah but uh, i am not the coordinator i am the i am the technical person the procedure is same okay i have to click on the coordinator registration then i have to uh, specify our my information yeah, in then i have to submit like username password your email id then your remote center name of your remote center after successful registration you have to use that username password With the same login page, after successful login, you are supposed to get the message waiting for main center quiz. If you are getting that message, it means that you are successfully configured with IIT server. Okay, let me try, sir. Then I will confirm you. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. One one nine five. Sir, is there any option on the A view to download or record the lectures delivered by you? No, 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 no. Sir, my next question is. We have successfully configured the clicker software. Okay. But uh, while on running the on the server, we need to disable our proxy server. Sir, is there any there is any option to run the clicker with the proxy server? No, some no, or some remote center with proxy also it's working fine. But what about in your case? It's work, it's not working with proxy server. The clicker server the configuration is working with the private IP, but not with the proxy server. Anyway, you just post it in you just post it in model. We okay, will, we are uh, we will give we a solution. Okay, we are looking into this matter. Why it's not working with proxy server? After get a solution, we will post it into model. Okay. Sir, my last question is: Can we create the quiz test 
by using clicker as an admin? No, 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 no it's not. Currently, currently it's not a provision to create your own quiz. Okay, in next version we will provide a option, the option to create your own quiz and you can contact with your students. 1197 We have installed all the software for the Tomcat server. But we are getting the error 404. What is the error? Uh, error, it is uh, HTTP status 404, okay, remote okay, Akash okay, clicker. Okay. Actually, we have not connected the Tomcat server to the internet right now. No, the Tomcat page is coming or not? Yes, it is coming. Okay, then you put the war file on the web apps folder, we already mentioned on the uh, presentation. Just put on the web apps folder, restart the Apache Tomcat server. Then you want to give localhost colon 8080 slash remote akas clicker then it will work 404 error means it is not able to find that folder uh -huh. sir whether we have to connect that tomcat server to the internet yes yes right now yes okay sir it is error due to that it is a 40 error means it is not able to find the package that folder is not able to find the remote akas clicker folder is not able to how we will come back okay. use that ppt the, step by step, then the you PPT, will the, the step by step information is there in that PPT. So, just follow that PPT, then you, you can configure it. If you have any issues, just post it on Moodle, we will help you. Uh, we have posted the same uh, question on the Moodle also yesterday. Uh, I think we, we, I have replied for the same. We have to follow the same instruction, it is given in a PPT. I am correct. Did you follow that one? Just please follow the same instruction in PPT. You will get the solution. Please okay. with your configuration. Okay, sir. Thank you. 1165. Uh, actually, we have uh, no standard systems in our uh, lab, and uh, we have configured uh, this uh, um, Ubuntu 12 on that PCs, and uh, we are not able to you know, configure that Apache server on that uh, particular Leno branded PCs. Uh, actually, uh, the, it is not accepting the packages which you have provided. 12.04. 12.04 will not support, sir. I already clearly mentioned the software we are sending. It is only for 10.04.4 32-bit version. The packages will support only for that. If you are configured 12.04, then you just download it from through Synaptic. You can connect to the internet and download it from there. Install it from there. Otherwise, use. Yeah, earlier we had configured 10.04 on that Leno PCs. It is not taking wireless LAN card, and the driver is not available on the website for that particular Leno PC. No, no. What I am saying is, you want not want to configure to all the machine for a single machine. You can configure 10.04, and you can use. There is no need for wireless network card. You can use wired network card. Nowadays, in the motherboard itself, the RJ45 connection is coming, network option is coming, so there is no need for. Okay, that's all. Okay. 1200. Uh -huh. How we can connect the coordinator server with the Wi Fi modem? In the Wi Fi modem is in the network, then you can connect. No, it is in the same network, then you can connect simply through IP address. Should, should we uh, have to take the input from the Wi Fi modem and uh, to be connected to the uh, coordinator server? Encryption means when you want to connect a tablet or a Wi-Fi device to connect an access point, that time you need encryption key, right? If you have that much staff and go everywhere and tell them to connect like this, then you can do that. Otherwise, we are suggesting open Wi-Fi. If it is an open Wi-Fi, you want to explain how to connect. If they click on the Wi-Fi uh, wireless, it will automatically connect. Otherwise, it will ask for a user ID and password. You want to give that user ID and password. Otherwise, you want to give a key. Yes, sir. So we have prepared the uh, clicker software, configured the clicker software. Uh -huh. And uh, we have done the uh, that uh, dummy server. Okay. Uh, now, sir, uh, we, uh, we need to ask that uh, what conf hardware configuration we need for that uh, uh, coordinator server. Configuration for the server. This Intel C1 processor, minimum 8 GB RAM. 1 TB or 500 GB into 2 hard disk. Sir, at present we have 500 GB ah, it's okay, hard disk. Fine. And sir, what's the processor speed? C1 processor, the speed and all the things we will put it on model. Sir, okay, sir. Okay, sir. Thank you. 1201.
uh, we have configured the Linux server uh, as well as the applications uh, and also the clicker software. But we need to, uh, how can we test the clicker? Is uh, it configured properly or not? Because there was no slide given in the presentation regarding testing of clicker. Okay, maybe you log in successfully. Yeah. Uh, after login, you get a message like waiting for main center quiz. That means it is working. It means that it is connected with our server. It's working perfectly. Okay. Thank you. Two zero seven. Okay. We have two access point, and uh, we want to configure. Uh, we want to configure uh, with this uh, setup. Okay. Is it possible to connect that uh, uh, connect and manage that connection? Because uh, in uh, that access point and Omni, we have only one uh, uh, RJ forty five connector. Uh -huh. Okay. You can connect. That access point, you, you can configure that access point and connect it to your local network. Fine. Okay, any other? Thank you, sir. Ah. Okay, I have a question. Uh, uh, how to connect to uh, Akash tablet? Ah. Actually, we not received yet Akash. Um, maybe your coordinator will come on fifth. For the coordinators workshop, that time we will provide two tablets. Using that tablets, you can test. Sorry, seventh and eighth, there is a testing session is there. So use, uh, using that tablet, you can test. But Nagash tablet can connect only through Wi-Fi. So Wi-Fi access point, otherwise Wi-Fi router. Uh, please configure and enable it for that. Okay. Any other question? Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. One two one nine. Ah, uh, sir, we have a Cisco Linksys. Uh, Wi-Fi system. Okay. So can we use this one for Wi-Fi purpose? Wi-Fi purpose, you can use this, but uh, when we are touched with uh, Cisco, some Wi-Fi routers, it is um, connecting only up to below 50, below 50 or 30. So according to the participants, if it is above 50, then you want to arrange more than one or two. Actually, we are also using Cisco here in Wi-Fi. This is the problem. When we are connecting around 100 tablets to one Wi-Fi access point, it is not accepting. Up to 50 only, it is yeah, accepting. No problem. Okay, okay. One two two eight. Sir, can we change the port number of Tomcat six? Yes, possible. Yeah, if we change the port number of Tomcat six by 80. Yeah. Whether it may give a conflict between the Apache and yes, uh, Tomcat, yes, yes, yes. because uh, we have to use. A yes, surely. Uh, can we have a solution to overcome that? <laughs> no. How we can listen two ports in a single machine, same port? Eight zero eight zero. What's the problem with eight zero eight zero? You have any problem with eight zero eight zero? No, sir. Actually, the this is just a question, sir. Okay. I just want to get the answer. Okay. Okay. Uh, regarding the configuration of Tomcat manager, mm -hmm. I have uh, tried to change the username and password, but it uh, won't show some the f some of the files. That means the permission. Mm -hmm. I think you want to go to that configuration file. There is a file called user.xml. From there, you want to change that. Yeah, I have changed that uh, username and password. Mm -hmm. So after giving the username and password in Tomcat manager, mm -hmm. uh, it won't show the thing. Uh, it won't show the resource. Okay, it's, do it's one thing. It's that uh, you we don't have thing. any per permission. Okay, do one thing. You just post it in the module. We will reply. Okay. Any the other? next question is uh, uh, to comp yeah to compile a Java servlet program. Uh, we need a API called servlet hyphen API dot jar. How can we set an open to uh, using that is a class path? Which ID you are using? You you do one thing. You use some IDs like Eclipse or NetBeans. Using that, you can easily do these things. If you configure a main project, right click on the project, then the properties, in the properties it will ask for the libraries, select the library, then you can see the jar option, click on the jar, you want to specify where the jar is, before that you just download the jar from the net and put it on a folder and specify the path, then the uh, you can compile that program, that is easy step. Okay, thank you, sir. The final question is whether we have to buy a micro SD card or SD card for a micro, micro SD card. Micro SD card. Okay, what is the minimum requirement, sir? Uh, the two size, whether it is 2 GB? 2 GB or 4 GB. I think 4 GB. I know. You can go for 4 GB. Yeah, okay. We can uh, use any of that. 
Okay, thank you, sir. Okay. One two zero two. If you have any query, quickly ask. Ah, uh, what is the minimum configuration of the open to server? I already announced it is Intel Xeon processor with minimum eight GB RAM, five hundred GB into two or one TB into two hard disk. 